What's up YouTube? Dubstep Slap 415. I know it's been a while since I've gone a full week without making a video, but I've just been super busy this past uh, week and got quite a few pickups to make up. Um, shouts out to WTFSAJC. He's having a snapback sale. 58 Space Jam. He's also selling some kicks. Shouts out to Horse Eddie. We stack boxes and the female sneaker addict. Female sneaker addict just made her account. Uh, one of the few repping the females in the sneaker game. So check her out, watch her vids, as well as We Stack Boxes. They just made their channel. So check them out. And one last one shouts out to Wet Paint 1978. He does some real sick uh, custom wood pieces. And you could put them next to good wood pieces and, you know, wouldn't be able to tell the difference. So. Keep your eye out for that. I got a custom piece on the way from him. Alright, first two pickups. Um, I got these off uh, eBay. They are the uh, DMC and Run vinyl figures. Uh, got them for about 10 bucks each. Made by uh, Pop Rocks. And I got these just to kind of go with my uh, Run DMC Adidas. So, shouts out to the dude I got those from. Uh, if you guys remember a while ago, I got a Jordan 4 pendant by Gabriel Urist, who's a uh, custom jewelry designer. Uh, I actually got another one from him. It's not directly from him, but it's from a dude that has a bunch of Gabriel Urist pieces. So here we go. It is a Nike Dunk. Got the little thing on the back for the chain. But just like the 4, crazy, crazy detail see the Nike so very very stoked with this comes in the little red box so gotta find a uh, old kinda like ball chain to go with that but uh, stoked to have it um, shouts out to the homie James Melton 34 when he hit me up asking me about um, Miami Knights he said that his shop had a tee that was a a perfect match for him so didn't hesitate, asked him to pick it up for me. Heir to the Throne in uh, charcoal gray, Heir in black, to the in vivid purple or vivid gray, and finally Throne in the uh, cherry. Got Nike with a check under it. So I believe he got this at a Champs, but hit up James Melton 34 if your local Champs is not selling that tee. Um, all right. I'm not sure if I told you guys, but I've got the Kobe 6 uh, Barcelonas on the way. Not the red and blue. I already got those, but the Mango Boys. And to uh, match with it, had to do it. Nike Dry Fit Barcelona Away jersey. Got the uh, crest on the left breast stitched in. It says, uh, Mesque Un Club. Nike Dry Fit Extra Large. Has the little yellow and red stripes right there. Um, let's see. Has the uh, LFP patch right there. UNICEF along with a Nike swoosh. Nothing on the back. So, very stoked to have gotten this jersey. Retails for 70 but I picked it up for about 30 bucks on eBay. So, st uh, stoked to have done that. Alright, um, I gotta give a big shout out to uh, Sean at 4U Caps. Uh, it's a dope site. I've been getting a lot of snapbacks from there and he hit me up saying that he wanted to uh, you know show some appreciation for all my constant business so he sent me out a little care package. Got the uh, House of Fitteds 4U bag. The Fresh EST New Era 950 in a uh, kind of like a dark khaki upper with red and green writing. This is a perfect match for the Patagonia Lowe's. Um, I now have this as well as the California Republic to go with them. For you, stitched in on the back. Very sick. And then he also threw in two t-shirts. This one right here. Foryoucaps.com, the fresh EST. And this is a uh, gray shirt, white writing, and the fresh is in uh, like a volt green. So, 
Big thanks, homie. And he also threw in one more tee. And this one is gray, black, and red. Same, the fresh EST for youcaps.com. So big shouts out to everyone at foryoucaps.com. You guys need to check them out. They've got some of the sickest snapbacks and they've got a lot of different companies. So people who might not like New Era can get, you know, Michelin Ness or Reebok or Adidas, whatever might suit you. Um, all right, so got six pairs for me and three pairs that aren't for me. So let's get into the pairs that are for me. Nike SB, Blue Box. Gonna make this a little quick. Nike Dunk High Pro SB, Dark Oak, Black, and Tar. These are the Oak Dunk Highs. <clears throat> They've got a combination of pebbled, like a pebbled Nubuck, as well as normal Nubuck. You can see the pebbles on the mid panel, as well as on the toe box. It's kind of remind me of an oatmeal raisin cookie, so I might start calling these the oatmeals. Let me know if you guys think that's a good uh, good name for them. You know, personally, with my oatmeal raisin cookies, I like to have a little chocolate chip. So that's where the swoosh comes in. Oh, got a little box falling. Here we go. Keep it moving. Another Nike SB box. Nike Dunk Mid Pro SB. Noble Green. Metallic Gold and Dark Oak. Like I said... I have the Patagonia mids on the way. Very happy with these. Um, one small touch that I really liked was the uh, little metal rivets in the uh, lace loops. Thought that was a very, very nice touch. Here we go. Patagonia lows with the EST fresh for you snapback. Perfect match. Very stoked to uh, actually put that there, put these on the ground. Very stoked to now have two hats because I don't usually like to wear the same hat. Um, but once again, keep it moving. Nike Dunk High Premium SB, Medium Gray, Smoke, and Cool Gray. This is a perfect colorway for a stoner, for a stoner shoe. But these are the Nike SB Tauntaun Highs. Tauntauns is a creature from Star Wars. Not huge on Star Wars, but I love this shoe. Really reminds me of the uh, skunks. Got a long hair suede on the top of the ankle, mid panel, and toe box. And then you've got like a fabric type wool material on the heel counter around the toe box and up the eyelets. Uh, you've got a smoke colored swoosh with a smoke lace. Definitely feeling that. I like to have my uh, swoosh match my laces, so thanks Nike SB for, for preventing me from uh, doing a lace swap. All right, let's keep it moving. Um, all right, let's do this pair. This one's, this one's some heat. All right, big shouts to my homie, Greg M 55 Without him, I wouldn't have gotten these. Never expected to get them, but fucking ecstatic that I did. Here we go. BOM 1913 16 for, uh, made for number 14 these were worn by Devon Beard at St. Vincent St. Mary's High School you got Irish on the back LeBron 8 V1 all green suede or new buck aside from the flywire You've got a, uh, I would assume the uh, official colors on these is white, metallic gold, and forest green or pine green, but super stoked to have gotten these. Gold inner lining, um, gold on the back of the tongue with the little green patch. Um, I'm not going to be able to get in there, but the little tag right there says SVSM promo, size 13. Um, so these were worn by Devont Beard, so these are not dead stock, but for being game worn, these are in immaculate shape. So big shouts to the homie Greg for hooking me up with definitely one of the most soft pairs of LeBron 8s. So here we go, boom, 91-96 DMP pack, 
you see what it is it's just trying to go a little quick already hit 10 minutes so 9196 this is not new it is a used pack but it got it for a pretty good deal so it couldn't pass on it here are the 11s so these are worn but still wanted the pack in my collection so it wasn't really tripping that it wasn't a uh, DS pack plus the price for a DS pack is crazy so here we go got the uh, DMP 11s gold jump man gold numbers yellowings not bad it's not great though the toe box is pretty good though on creasing wise so definitely stoked to have gotten these and because these are already worn I'm not gonna feel bad about wearing them the 6 is definitely uh, better than the 11 so here we go DMP 6s gold jumpman on the tongue black jumpman with the gold 23 gold all along the side gold along the pull tab yellowing on these is not too bad there's one spot that's kind of starting to orange but that's about it definitely gonna be rocking those boys so that's the DMP pack and now let's move on to the three pairs that aren't for me now um, I don't have a kid on the way a lot of people thought I did when I posted this pick on Twitter but I wanted to start a collection from my kid so I don't have to uh, worry about getting all the expensive shoes because I don't know if these shoes are gonna be out when I have a kid so first 6c Jordan 3 retro black varsity red and cement gray a little receipt these are black cement threes and I was very very surprised from the quality on these was not expecting them to be that good keep it moving 8c Jordan 3 retro cool gray black or blue glow and uh, neutral gray so these just came out only in girl sizes as well as toddler so was not gonna sleep on these especially because I wasn't able to get a pair but here we go gray flips blue jumpman on the back blue jumpman on the tongue got that flip cement all the way around so there you go one more it's a size 9c stealth varsity red and light graphite black these are the stealth threes and pretty much uh, I'm gonna have a collection of probably threes sevens and maybe fives but uh, there you go three pairs that aren't for me black cement threes stealth threes and your cool gray threes so there you go see all the jump man on the back alright guys Hope you enjoyed this video. Hope it made up for the week without pickups, and I'll be back in a few days with some more. I was expecting some today, but uh, they'll probably be coming on Monday just because it's getting close to Christmas, so my post office is going to be busy. All right, guys. Peace.